This is a podcast of Nathan, Nat and Sean. Let's go! As you may know by now, uh, the project is in Perth all week um, and celebrating everything that's oh Western Australian, to be honest. Loitering in Kings Park. Waleed Ali joins us in the studio. Oh, Loitering's Waleed. harsh. It is. It's loitering. <laughs> what, 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 were we kind of invited? Mm. Yeah. Can you, can you? Oh, we did. Us three did. And Channel Ten said you have mm. to have Wiley. Nah, no, yeah, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. No, we're happy to have you in here. Absolutely, I'm really happy to be here. Thank you. Yeah. But we have been. I mean, that was just saying we are celebrating everything mm. WA. All the project is, but yeah. not you. You're not out and about like the rest of them who are out doing amazing things yeah. all around our yeah. fair state. I'm annoyed about this. Can you do something about no. it? <laughs> what are you going <laughs> to do? Well, well, Rose well, a certainty, by the way, to I, go up to yeah. Coral Bay, Exmouthy stuff, and do yeah, that. Yeah. That was a certainty. Okay, Sean. So you're very well placed. Yes. Get stuck into him, please. <laughs> what uh, did you uh, want to do? What do you feel like you've missed out on? I, I wanted dolphins oh. or something. We well, can yeah. bring your dolphin in here. <laughs> can you in here? <laughs> yes. I mean, okay. granted, it probably won't survive too much longer afterwards. But if you <laughs> but want if to, Wally you're, wants you're, a dolphin. A, you're a huge celebrity <laughs> from the eastern states. <laughs> if there if there are no cameras, <laughs> <laughs> there is no point. <laughs> you'll, only, <laughs> you'll only risk a dolphin's life if it's on TV. <laughs> yeah. I, I wanted to go to Broome. I've heard yes. so many great things about it. Is Broome. Beautiful. And then we crossed to Lisa last night yep. in yes. Broome. I know. And she just happens to have this backdrop of like camels. This caravan camels. of camels. I'm just I, like, I mean, shut yeah. up. Yeah. yeah. What is that? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, they look better than what they are. They stink, those oh, things. Do they? Oh, <laughs> Wale. You need a thousand magic trees on those. You're really helping me here. This is <laughs> yeah. You don't want to need do all that. the what, what else do you want to do? And we'll tell you what was wrong with it. Um, I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Margaret River. What's wrong with Margaret, Margaret River? Margaret River, um, what it is, it's just um, too many woke people selling dream catchers. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay. This yeah, is good. and then everything's feathered. So, oh. so you're poor man's Byron Bay. Right. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah Byron Bay without the influences. So what's honest. the point of that? Right. <laughs> Margaret yeah, without River the reality so TV yeah. show. So, well, I hate, I hate feathers, so yeah. that's oh, okay. good. Yeah. Byron okay. Bay, yeah. get stuff. Yes. Don't need it. Yeah. All right. Esperance looked pretty great. Oh, that's my hometown. Esperance is uh, beautiful, but everything shuts, everything shuts at 7 p.m. <laughs> and yeah, it's very sharky. Oh. Seven very, is late. Very that's sharp. a late night. Sorry, actually, 6 p.m. And I'm not, when I say everything, I mean even your door. If you're it's, staying somewhere at a hotel, you need to be in by 6. And wow. it's super sharky. Oh, yeah, and you'll the get water, though, oh. they are the most spectacular beaches yes. in the world. Freezing water. Yeah. Oh. So cold. Yeah. Yeah. So cold. Yeah. Hang on, you realise you're talking to a Victorian. Mm, no, di- even no. by vi- I, I, I it's lived in Melbourne. Territory. It is so cold. Yeah, really. Yeah. Yeah, it's next yeah. level. Yeah. This is great. Yeah, yeah. You guys have done yeah. a really Where good else? job yeah. of trashing yeah. your state. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, um, I understand <laughs> you haven't brought up my hometown, Kalgoorlie. You didn't want to go there. Well, I just, I'm just not that good a miner. It's a, it's a giant. No, hole. You don't need to be a child. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> well I love a good pun. You think it's so I much? love a good pun. Yeah, no. What's, yeah. What is Kalgoorlie like? Um, Kalgoorlie is beautiful metropolis. Mm. Okay, Kalgoorlie is a great place. Um, yeah. uh, it, you can do a brothel tour. Which okay. is fantastic. Um, I've got to be very careful how I respond to your yes, suggestions. Yes, yes. Yeah, so what you do is you go to the ATM, you get $80. <laughs> 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 they take you. Well, you, don't get <laughs> you don't get much, but cafe, you'll come out like, for that. with tears in your eyes. Um, no, wow. so basically they um, will take you on a brothel tour. And, and, and the one that we went to, Natalie, mm. remember? It's um, all different themed rooms. Right. Um, it's eye-opening. Yeah, it's eye opening. Mm. Eye opening. And other things open. <laughs> are, but the, the other ones are just like, they're like horse stables um, where the girls um, just stand in the, the front of the horse stable and they try to lure you Converted in. old horse we stables. Oh, okay, right. You yeah, made yeah, it sound yeah. like they yeah. were like just, you know, horses yeah. around. Yeah, we're not at Flemington. Just no, on the no, 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 <laughs> that one there's $200. <laughs> oh, right, okay. But I used to ride past them while I'd on the um, way to get a video from Blockbuster Video with my, yes. my, my brother and I. So we used yeah. to like pedal past and have BMXs when we were kids. And yeah. Uh, the joke would be when the um, guys were there um, trying to chat up the girls and negotiate a price, you'd yell out, Dad, come home, they want you. And the guys would all freak out. That's very good. Yeah. You show touching familiarity with the prices, yes. by the way. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell by we're not employed by tourism? Don't we? I mean, I thought it all looked very lovely, but you're really talking around here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but thank you. I appreciate it. As, as great as Kings Park is, and mm. it is stunning. Thank you. And actually, the first time I ever came to Perth, mm. um, was on a mystery flight. Do you remember that? Oh, yes. 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 And it was the weirdest thing because 
um, it was like I hit the jackpot. I went to Perth. Like, yeah. It's like a $10 trip to Perth. This is it's incredible. Right. But it was only when we were in the midst of it we realised, oh, we've got like 10 minutes <laughs> before we have to get <laughs> back on the plane. <laughs> so, so in that 10 minutes, <laughs> we went to Kings Park. Oh, and we, we looked over this thing and it was like, yeah. well, I think it's a beautiful <laughs> scene. <laughs> yeah. I mean, granted, when you look closer, everyone's getting mugged and there's a thousand million guns in the suburbs. Wow, you're really down on this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to make you feel better. Been reading the paper. <laughs> but anyway, Kings Park's lovely, and it's yeah, great to be there. And you, also, yeah. the setup we've got, and because we're doing this, um, an extra show live just for Perth. Yeah. Yes. At sun, it's right at sunset. Yeah. yeah. Which is bad because one of the things I really wanted to do was see the sunset over the ocean. Yeah, of course. Because that's such a you know great thing to do here. Yes. But it looks stunning for us. Yeah. It's yeah, a lovely time to be outside. Doing a TV show outside's. You don't do it very often. No, yeah. it's true. With the, those mics, they're right up against your face. Because yeah. I was just the Madonna mics. Are they, are they annoying you? Or no, they? they're all right because you know what? They've slowly just gotten further and further <laughs> away <laughs> over the time. So I don't know if I can be heard, <laughs> <laughs> but I relatively can. The worst bit about them is the bit behind the ears. Actually, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah it's not the it's not the mic on the cheek. It's the yeah. That's hard. They gave them to us one um, show that we we're doing an outside broadcast, and all we could hear was this. <laughs> Because <laughs> <laughs> they were like right up near our noses. <laughs> oh, that's kind of like the soundtrack. It's probably taking you a lot of wind. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, but we do know that you're like an award-winning journalist, um, yes. and you know you can like hit the serious topics really well. But mm. uh, question, Riley, mm, mm. we know your love of music. Mm, mm. If you had a choice right now mm. between doing what you're doing right now, yep. and then or leaving that behind mm. and having the most successful rock career, uh. talk to me. Well, it's an obvious choice. The Walkley's in the bin, isn't it? Yeah, God. Walkley is in the bin. <laughs> I'm and making I'm, room for the Grammy. I'm melting down the Walkley and I'm turning it into <laughs> tuning pegs for my guitar. <laughs> and I'm playing with Pink Floyd or whatever the equivalent would be. Yeah, that's. Well, okay, what, what about. Um, e- okay, so the music career is there. We've got yeah. rid of the journalism stuff and yeah, you're okay. on telly. Well, yeah. um, you get a call from the Tigers. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> All of a sudden, Benny Gale, CEO, he gives yep. you a call. He yep. said, Dimmer's been watching you. Wants to do what? Get well, him on the field. Everyone in the else has got COVID. In the days over the last Can couple of years field. and yeah. play for the mighty Tigers. So in this hypothetical scenario, okay. uh, can I adjust for the fact that I'm no good at footy? Yeah. Like, so I'm oh, good yeah. at okay. footy. Okay, so you're amazing so at whatever amazing. you do next. Oh, well, then I'm playing for the Tigers. <laughs> There's I'm no question. Music. Yeah. But no, but like that's the more way more running. Kind of, but I, true. That, well, <laughs> that depends on the kind of rock show you do. That's true. Actually. That's true. It does. No, no, I think it would have to be because... So debut in a grand final. That's not a, the Marlon, Marlon Pickett, Pickett story. Marlon yes. Pickett. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can, I, can I throw something in the mix? Yeah. All right. Sure. So there's only a certain salary cap that you'll be able to make playing <laughs> football. Yeah. And then worldwide wide rock stardom. Yeah. I mean, while they do you want to do the math? I didn't not, do math in year 11 or I'm, 12, but I can whip out a calculator. Yeah. You, well, you... You have a natural talent for maths. Thank you. So <laughs> it's You've long done division. Well. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, I'm not a material person. Ah. So no sorry, one believes me. <laughs> 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 yeah. so it's not about oh, the money sorry. for you. It's about no. the experience. It's no. It's about the glory. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Is there anything better? Well, would, oh. well, I don't know. I've never done. Oh, it. Do you would, want to throw on Norm Smith medal while you're yeah, at it? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> sure. Would there be anything better than holding up Premiership Cup? I've would never, there be? I've never done it. <laughs> Wow, that really hurts. Or some equivalent. Oh, Eastern Mantle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know. Yes. Actually, and I want to ask you, Sean. Yes. If you could hold up one trophy in sport, mm. what would it be? I mean, the ashes because it's light. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, obviously, you take, With your if, if you also take remember. AFL out of it. If well, also you, take can, out you of can throw it in if you want. You can say okay, that's so the that's ultimate. Yeah. Footy. Wouldn't it be the, that it, big plate from Wimbledon? Oh, or as oh, Sean calls geez. it, Wimbledon? Wimbledon. <laughs> I think winning a World Cup in the round ball game yeah. Reckon, yeah. would be the ultimate thing. What you would thing? be revered around the world for eternity. Yeah, I reckon. If you it, got a shot, if you got a, a penalty, the World Cup's on, right? Yeah, yeah. And you get it down to it's you're playing Brazil in the, in the final for the trophy, and then it's all of a sudden a free kick with you know yeah. a couple of minutes to go, and yeah. you zip one in past the keeper who's diving at full stretch. Yes, you could not stop me running with my clothes on. <laughs> I'd have everything off, just going absolutely mental, and I'd just be running around. They'd be doing presentations. Yes. I'd still be yeah. running around with my shirt, <laughs> waving around my head. Why won't he lift the, the trophy? <laughs> Why is it just running around in the oh. nutty? What's going on? Turns out he's not in it. <laughs> all. all he wanted was a nudie run. Well, that can be arranged. <laughs> Let's go back to your music. Um, wh- yeah. What what sort of um, uh, opportunities have you been given since your you know national you know Australia sweetheart? <laughs> 
Um, <laughs> what, was I on The Bachelor? <laughs> you didn't need to be. That's, that's the full-on thing. Have you been given some really great opportunities to combine music with your... Yeah. Yeah. Well, actually, one of the, it was actually kind of before I was at yeah. the project. One of the best things I ever did, you know, you know, the Chaser. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. They, yeah. They did these live shows that were like kind of like chat shows, but comedy type things. Yeah. And they made us, like, my band, they made us the house band. Oh. And so we did all, and How it was exciting. amazing. So we got to play our own set and whatever. But then we also had to punctuate their things. So like do their <laughs> play ons and all this sort of stuff. Yeah. And yes. it was the most fun. And there was a time where um, some guest came on, I can't remember exactly who it was, but they they were doing their book or their thing they were talking about had something to do with Asia. And we just by total coincidence started playing Africa by total <laughs> 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 We every now and then it gets us up in here. Yeah. Okay. It's like you know they're not the same <laughs> place. <laughs> it was just incredible. Um, it was great. We learnt the Simpsons theme for yeah, that. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's great. great. Which is an amazing piece of music. Like you forget about it because it's just a TV yeah, show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you stop and listen to that, it's like an incredible piece of music. And the piano player having dun, to do all dun, that dun, stuff. Dun, yeah. Dun. Yeah. Oh, you told us a, a story about playing piano just before we were off. Don't air. do this to no, me. No, you need to. Why? No, well, that was your ISO no, project. No one cares. It was it's really piano. interesting. It's not that it interesting. It's so humbling and it makes you just. Australia will fall in love with you more. All over again. Another gold logie. Another gold logie. I think, I think you're setting me up forever. <laughs> no, I'm not. Me. Uh, all right, fine. I'm going to do this, Everyone. but this is your fault. Okay? <laughs> okay, Nathan. Yep. Na- Nathan's done this to me. Okay, all right. everyone, get it. everyone all right. be prepared. So in lockdown, yeah. you might know that in Melbourne we had roughly 405 years of lockdown. Yeah, in the last, you did. In the last two. Yeah. So I started trying to teach myself how to play piano because yeah. I play guitar, yeah. right? And guitar's fine. Yeah. I find that an easy instrument. Piano, I think, is one of the hardest things you can do in the world. I know. It's just so hard. Delta Goodrum respect. Mm. Yes, I yes. agree. No, she's so, in town too. Yeah. Oh, she, yeah, yeah. she played she last night. Shout out. Why, shout why out. are you talking to her? <laughs> Half capacity. I oh, shouldn't come in. <laughs> <laughs> she's busy playing with the dolphins. Yeah, she like, caught us the tears last time. <laughs> um, anyway, so uh, over the, the years, I've somehow become friends with Ben Foltz. Name dropper. Player. What a name yeah. dropper. <laughs> That's I what this that, is all about. I know Rove's a massive fan. Is he really? Oh, actually, I know no Rove knows him because Rove yep. was recently on his podcast, wasn't he? Yep. He did, yep. yes. I remember. Because anyway. Anyway. Because um, you're besties. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, I was, and I, I, Ben and I text and stuff quite a lot and about music often. <laughs> yes. And he'll tell me about why Beethoven is everything and all this sort of stuff. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, sure, you know stuff. Anyway, he, he's got this song called Philosophy with okay. Ben Foles' fire song, which I love. Yeah. And the piano intro is just incredible. Here we go. And I thought. Oh, listen. Oh, have we got it? Yeah. Power of radio. What did you want to do so with that? I was you wanted like, to learn that. I wanted to know if I could play As that. a rank beginner. Yes, because what I've discovered in music is sometimes something sounds hard and it isn't. Ah. And something, sometimes something sounds easy and it's hard. Because by the sound of the, uh, that, that, you require 15 fingers. Yes, <laughs> exactly. So I asked him, I said, I said, did you, is that as hard as it sounds? Yeah. And he said, well, it's hard for me to say because I just play, I yes. wrote it, I just play it. But what I'll do is I'll do you a video. Yeah. So he's got, he's been living in Sydney for yeah. the last couple of years and he's got this um, set up with his keyboard and a camera that looks down on it from above. Yes. And he does YouTube stuff and whatever. Yeah. And so he made a video for me playing that and he broke it down. This is how it goes. Now here's the left hand, here's the right hand. Um, and then just took me through the rest of the song. And so I just spent the next month or two. So can you play that? Slowly, now? yes. <gasps> you um, can really play that. Not, I, no, well, I don't want you to think I no, no, play it no, like no. a virtuoso. Bring in the organ. Right. <laughs> 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 it would sound really weird on an organ. <laughs> but yeah, so that was my lockdown. This is how long we were in lockdown. I just did a dumb jigsaw, but we were only in lockdown for like 12 <laughs> yeah, days. Yeah, that's, well, that's all you had. Yeah, I was yeah. going to clean my spare bedroom, I didn't. Yeah. There you go. I'm going to clean but no, Ben Folds sent him a video. A video, yeah. I had to do it. Facing down and, and doing that. Um, yeah, very good. We love this. Is the first time you've ever come in. Thank you so much. For yeah. Thanks for having yeah, me. With us. No, I appreciate it. Yeah. It's been good fun. Yeah. So you're around all week till Friday before you guys fly out? I'm doing the f- all five shows, yes. Yep. Uh, and then I fly out Saturday morning. Yeah, quite early. So that's good. It's a shame. I really wanted to get to a footy game while I was here because I've never been to Optus. Oh. No, uh, Fremantle playing Saints on uh, Sunday. Yeah. So you missed that weekend's so, game. So it's a bit long. But I know the Tigers come back, yeah. I don't know, somewhere in April? Maybe in May? I yeah, think you're in trouble this year. Yeah, I think we are too. Yeah. Mm. Uh, yeah. Wiley would really like to go over to Rotnest and um, Padaquaka too, yes. um, but the project are refusing to organise for him. So <laughs> if anyone that's got the helicopter and stuff would like to get in contact with Channel 10, 
Waleed would love to do that over the next couple of You've days. You changed your tune. I thought you were meant to tell me what was terrible about <laughs> Rottnest Island. Isn't that the isn't that the plan? Oh, the, no, the uh, the the, the quokka will give you ringworm. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, away from that. They're actually delightful. No, you can't say anything bad about them. You can't touch them. You can't touch them. You bet you can pose next. And to do them. you know oh, okay. if they leave the island, they can never come back? What? Yes, yes, I might bring back the like, It's yeah. like I was going to say it's like Survivor, but no, Survivor they have all stars. Yes, yeah, it is. It's like it's like WA in Kofi. That's what it is. <laughs> That's exactly right. That's where Mark got the idea from. Um, thank you so much, Wiley. It's Thanks, been an absolute guys. pleasure. Nathan, Nat and Sean is a Nova podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcasts.com.au.